Hey everybody, I'm Nila Hansen. I'm a stunt performer and an actress. I do stunts for film and TV, and I also do a lot of performance for video games. So that's why we're here today to talk about the cutscenes in Horizon Forbidden West, where I did a lot of female performance for a lot of the characters. Now I'm gonna try to tell you guys about how we did this, how we made this amazing action happen. Okay guys, before you keep watching this video, major spoiler alerts for what's gonna happen. So if you guys don't wanna know anything, maybe go play the game and then come back to the video. And I thought we should start with the beginning of the game, because this is, if you all paid attention, for you guys have played this, this is actually motion capture that we did for the trailer, and that is now used in the beginning of the game as well. And this is my first time doing motion capture for Aloy. So this is me, you guys. That's me climbing. So we're in the studio, we have like two rails. So I'm holding onto a rail and I'm jumping up to, you know, catch another rail. And this was just such a cool experience to like how, like, cause Aloy, she's like, you're climbing in the game, right? So, and she's super strong, but we still, it was really, really important for us to make sure that she felt like she's still human, human kind of, she's still human. She's, you should still be able to, you know, feel for her and kind of see yourself as her. But this was a really challenging thing. I was holding on with one hand. So we, we usually cut it up pretty much. So this move that we're doing here, that was like this one move that we were doing, I was holding on and then they were like, so then you reach up and you try to go to like the next grab or the next hold. And, and I was like, okay, yeah, yeah, I can do it. Cause I'm like, I'm Aloy, I can do it. Like I can do anything, right? And I was like, ah, I can't do it. Like I can't do it. I can't do a one arm pull up, apparently. Of course I can't do one arm pull up, but I really thought I would be able to do it cause I was Aloy, you know? So I had, a really you know good friend of mine at the studio hold on to my legs and like push me up so in this shot this like he's pushing me up from below and you can, like we're still capturing my face and everything but yeah you need your friends when you're shooting stuff for Aloy <laughs> okay this was nice this was like I I want to say this was one of the first time we were like trying to really understand like how Aloy does it with the bow like and this like putting the bow back oh that's a whole situation like putting the bow back putting the spear back because we want it to be quick and easy we don't want people to be like looking at her trying to get the bow back we want it to be quick but also kind of make sense so it does sometimes sometimes it doesn't but but we really <laughs> tried our best to make it look cool and fast but still make sense Okay, this is the first time we kind of meet the Tanakh tribe. So they're with us for the game. We did so much for them because they're like warrior, This, these three warrior clans. They're super cool. We did so much, like, we did so many cool things for them. This is the, kind of the first time that we see them. And uh, we did this battle. Let me just skip forward a little bit more. And here's Ugala. The, like, a female badass boss. I did tons of gameplay for her and a lot of cinematic movement as well. Um, that was so much fun, like going in between, like jumping in between doing Aloy sometimes and doing Regala. Like, they're super cool, you know, females, but Regala's just like so, like cutting edge badass bitch. <laughs> and she's like, she's just so tough. And all of those girls as well, like we're doing that too. So we're just jumping between these amazing female characters. And this is me like jumping up on top of like a gray box, <laughs> which that machine is like, every time you're riding, you see a character riding machine in this game. It's someone on this gray wooden box, like pretending to be on a machine. Um, and phew, that's, hilarious you're like at work and you're with your best friends on gray boxes like pretending to ride and you're like what are we doing are we getting paid to do this like it's crazy this is us shooting some arrows like that's the whole whole thing as well like what style you want to do your 
Ooh, that's probably like Niklas or Yuan, I want to say. That's me dragging one of them over to cover. Like, we're having so much fun doing this, guys. Like, just imagine shooting arrows. Like, oh, yeah, like, yeah, like shooting arrows. That's something you know how, like, what, you know, you know how to react. Okay, this last one I want to show you guys. This is pretty early on as well. Uh... I saw that, so we have a previs for before we shoot something, we get a previs, like something, how it's supposed to look, well, how the story's supposed to go and what we want to shoot, uh, previsualization. And I saw this one and I was like, oh my God, like, how are we going to do this? I'm going to die. But obviously I never thought I was going to die, but I was like, how are we going to do this? So the whole structure is like collapsing onto these machines. Um, and we're, so now we've built a platform which it's attached by wire so the whole platform is moving so we did that on the like in the volume the whole platform is moving and we have a railing so i'm holding on to the railing and so we do that was one section and then we have one, one section where it's like flipping down and i'm like sliding off it is that here it looks so good and then i'm jumping off and then this is a new section of me holding on to a bar like dangling in there letting go it wasn't that high it was like only a meter but they like make it longer this was a whole thing oh my god the rope jump this was a struggle <laughs> i want to say like i tried my best and they made it look so good i think it looked good eventually too but that was like it was just i went back a little bit okay it was just like freaking cool you know so we had this platform like an l-shaped platform and i was just like running and then like jumping and then they're like can you go further i was like yeah i can go further i'm aloy like you always go back to it. like i'm aloy of course i can go further so i try to go further and like can you go further yes i'm aloy i can go further you know um and it looks super cool <sighs> i'm so happy with that um once i i was like going for it and my mind just blanked in the air and i like tried to catch the rope but I didn't catch the rope, so I just fell flat on the ground, and it, I was fine, I was fine, I got this rope burn on my neck, whatever, but <laughs> that does happen, like, you crash to the ground, and then you just, you're okay, you're fine, you just go up, and you just do it again, you know, and you just do it better than before, and this was all the whole thing, swing, swing, these, we have these platforms that are like, choo, 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 just run, try to make it look cool, jump roll all these rolls this is i love doing this doing aloy like doing all her crash rolls that was probably like my favorite part of doing her is like crashing all the time every day and then getting up like dusting yourself off and like okay what's next So if you guys want to see me play other games that I've done movement for or react to, I don't know, other games and other mocha performances, give me a like or comment and maybe I will. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it.